Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to do another video and it's on who's going to see the coldest fall temperatures this year, 2017. And fall is not the coldest time of the year, obviously, and it's not the warmest, but it's a transition period between the warm phase and the cold phase of the year. And technically, fall extends all the way into December 21st, so fall can be quite cold and... Um, I will also be making a video on who will be receiving the best chances at snow this fall because that's it's just it happens all the time. We had a snowstorm in 2015 here and it was in November 21st, 2015. You could type that in on YouTube and it will show up. We got 11 inches. It was quite a storm. So I'm just making this video because it can get quite cold in fall. So first off, our most reliable source by far is the NOAA three month outlook temperature probability. And this is for September, October, and November average. You could just see off the map. There were some years where it's actually blue, but in this in this um area, it's oh sorry. In this um this pretty much is just all orange and red. So that just means that in general this fall for every single one is going to be slightly above average, in some cases much above average. Look at northern Alaska, that's some dark red, almost magenta color, so that's going to indicate a very, very uh, above average um, uh, fall in northern Alaska. So there's the southwest will be above average for September, October, November, and in general the whole country will be warmer than average, so this fall should be a pretty nice fall. But it's going to cool down as we get on. This is for October, November, December. Um, it's pretty much still, again, the same story. It's going to be warm across for most of the country. It's going to be, it's just going to be a nice fall. And the ENCO outlook is, ENCO outlook is neutral for, for November uh, for for September, October, November, and October, November, December, it's neutral, and you can see right here, ENCO neutral is favored, 85% chance during July through September, decreasing to 55% December through February, F through the Northern Hemisphere, winter 2017-2018. So, um, neutral pattern, it can't really give us much because the neutral pattern for the winter means that it's going to be cold across the north and warm across the south and wetter across the south but I don't know if that necessarily means it for the fall so I didn't include it cause, so this doesn't give us that much but overall probably the coolest area of the fall will be in the northern sections and the, and the southeast and the warmest sections will be the northeast and the southwest the central central of the country will be about above average but not not too much about above average and not too below average there's gonna be not a single state that's below average so this is in general a very nice warm season of fall it's gonna be nice fall the coldest temperatures obviously it's not gonna be it's not gonna be like it's not gonna be warm meaning 70s and 80s and 90s in Chicago or Detroit Michigan it's gonna be just like the average fall 50s 60s but maybe a couple degrees above average so that does that make a whole lot of a difference not really but can you feel it can you sense it kind of so in a way in some ways it makes a difference in some ways it doesn't but the fall foliage across most of the country will be pretty this year i have a video on that if you want to check that out so thank you guys so much for watching please consider liking and subscribing see you guys in the next episode